What is up, my beautiful people? Welcome back to another video with your girl, Pamela Janani. Welcome back to my channel. What is the Vibe Tribe? Happy, happy Saturday. Happy, happy Saturday. So where I live, it is, well, it snowed a little bit yesterday, okay? And I was not here for it. Now, I do not like the fact that global warming has taken over our world and our weather is not the same as when we were young kids, okay? But, you know, we kind of got spoiled, all right? And there was snow and it's freezing again. And we were so spoiled with nice warm weather. So there's snow outside. It's not like you can't drive in it, you know, because we do have errands today. But it's cold, and I'm not one of those Florida girls who just want to be in Florida and enjoy the sun. I don't really like the sun like that because I just don't. But can I please have my 60s and my 70s back, please? That hasn't come to us yet, but that's all I want, okay? But I don't want to complain about anything because I am grateful that, you know, there's a lot of things that are going on in the world and cold weather and snow is not one of those things that I should be complaining about. So, I love you guys. Drop in the comments down below where you're from. If you don't want to say where you're from, comment down your weather today, okay? How is your weather, all right? So, with that being said, if you are not subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and do so right now. Support your girl on this journey that I once always say is bigger than me because it is, darling. Let's go. So, it is dark in my home. It is early in the morning, and it's not dark, but it's not, like, light. And I'm using a light that I have above me, Okay? Um, it's one of those lights that you can adjust, you know, it dims the lights, all sexy and stuff, okay? But I don't know if I have it too bright or not. Don't know. But I'm going to leave it as it is today because I am not getting up. Mm -mm, I'm not getting up. I don't really know how. Let's go. Let's tap into this video. So don't be mad. And this is not you, my beautiful people. This is These are the people who, who try to set a plan for you, for your life. A lot of them are mad. They're angry. They are not happy because they set a trap for you and God had another route for you. See, a lot of people thought that because they did what they did to you, that you would fall into the hole that they dug for you, that you would do no, nothing. You wouldn't, you wouldn't try, you're not going to get up. You're not going to fight for your life is what they thought. God says, oh, 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 oh no. People are mad because they tried to ruin you. And not only did you tear down what they have built around you. They built lies around you. They built these false stories around you. They built a whole new you. And you tore everything down because you wanted to get out. You wanted to get out. We never belong in a place that traps us into anything, let alone lies, let alone illusions that people have painted on to us. Let's tap into this again. God made you come out looking better than ever. A lot of you guys went through a storm in 2022, storm in 2023, a storm. A lot of you are going through a storm right now that runs deep. But you will, you have gotten out. Because a lot of you guys, if you're like me, we don't belong in a box. We are not to be placed in a box that God didn't place us in. If I want to be in a box, I'm going to say, God, put me in a box that you want me to be in. So the, the, you know the routes for me to get out. God knows the routes for us to get out. So our enemies and your enemies thought that they placed you in a box. They thought that they sent you down a route that you would not know how to get away from. But that is not the case. We know how to run. We know how to pray. We know how to be kind. We know how to cry. We know how to forgive. We don't know how to retaliate. We don't know how to seek revenge. We don't know how to do black magic. We don't know how to manipulate. We don't know how to gaslight. We don't know how to do those things. And that is a bonus. But we know of those things. And when you know of those things, but you don't do those things, that is when the magic truly happens. In that box, on that route that someone tried to trap you on or in. Let's tap into it some more. Your enemies shouldn't be disappointed. They should take this reality check. The wicked people in the world who are trying to tap and bother God's people need to take their defeats as a reality check. Wake up. Wake the fuck up. Wake up. They need to wake up. Let's tap into it some more. 
They need to dive deep into the word of God. Every attempt to stop you will add an abundance to you and I. Every attempt to stop you will be an added abundance to you. Is this not something that they don't see or understand? Because they should see that when they try to destroy you, God just blesses you. When they try to destroy you, God simply blesses you. This take, let's take a step back. We don't retaliate. We don't hate. We don't seek revenge. We just have a glow up. A glow up that starts from the inside and comes out on the outside. That is the difference between you and, and the enemy and, and the devil's people. They like to glow up on the outside. They like to buy that pretty house. They like to drive that fancy car. They like to look good on the outside when the inside is suffering. That is not the case of God's people. Let's tap into it some more. Every ill thing done to you only makes you love deeper, only makes you smell hardy, harder, only amplifies your gratitude for each day that you breathe. You're looking good. You pass the test. You show loyalty. You show respect not only to God, but to yourself, to the kingdom of God. The wicked needs to know that every old new roadblock attack tossed at you only comes with a heavy price tag for them. They think that what they did, they put a price, they put a, not a price tag, they put a tag on you. So that everybody that see you will see what they wrote on that tag. But that is not the case. Because everybody that sees and believes the tag that they wrote on you, lies, slander, all of those things that they placed on you for other people to see, all of those lies that they told, only makes you look good. You're not walking in that label that they placed on your back. You're not walking in the shoes that they, they said you will walk in. Keep showing up. Keep showing out. Team God. Team God. That is it for this video, my beautiful people. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you beautiful, kind souls in the next video. Love and blessings. Bye.